so here we go then guys look at this lot hey eh? farmer very kindly has lent us one of his cattles cattle um transport we've got music in there all the tea coffee facilities that we've got for the dig we've got raffle prizes yet to be set up over there there's our pete doing a runny we've got the gazebo set up just there where it'll keep us nice and dry so we've got nice little area there look at all these campers and we're on the first night this is only friday look at the views that we've got hey this is where chack stock where we are now is where chack stock festival was held the chack stock festival finished yesterday and we've come straight in today just look at the views over dartmoor absolutely outstanding look at that it's a bit windy and we have been given a yellow weather warning for sunday but hey we've had nothing but dry dry weather so a bit of rain won't hurt us will it hey no so i'll catch you a bit later then guys just wanted to show you what it was like on the friday night of arrival it's taken us about three hours so far to set this lot up all hard work done by the admin team there's our pete luke little polo his dog <laughs> all right then guys so i'll catch you a bit later so friday night's entertainment then guys this is us we're just waiting for we are just waiting for everybody else to turn up and we're going to have a go at the pub quiz now i've spent hours and hours and hours and hours and hours preparing these 140 questions oh we've got a flashy doodah up there look at that hey look at that that's amazing isn't it is it all flashy as well and have a look up there in a minute guys like well I like it yeah. oh well just look at where we are I'm hoping that the clouds are gonna disappear and I can watch the blood moon and all the constellations of the stars in this wonderful wonderful area where we are it's really unfortunate that we've got rain coming in tomorrow and heavy rain on uh, Sunday but we're hoping oh look got a disco going over here look here look at that I don't I don't know where I'm walking you can't see me guys but I'm walking all funny look look we've got disco lights look at that look hey everybody be under them in a minute look at look look the cameras dancing way this is our vodka lady did I just say that oh, oh dear yeah. <laughs> and this is where it's all going on guys all the decks and all the raffle prizes are all in there tea and coffee and everything i can't tell you how excited i am i don't think i'm going to sleep tonight <clears throat> well everybody's gone to bed now and i am watching the blood moon i was so hoping that the clouds would pass and i'm really sorry about the wind but i can't get into get my um, wind socks I'm just covering you a little bit and there guys is the moon eclipsing and once it's fully eclipsed it will be a really bright well should be bright blood moon look at that probably isn't much to you but means the world to me could be in a nicer place even though it is very very, very breezy so there you are there you have it night number one done and dusted night then guys Mwah. kissy kissy <laughs> guys i'm in bed 
and it's late at night and I keep hearing this squealing like animal squealing What is that? What? Can you hear this guys? Can you hear this? I'm in a tent in the middle of nowhere and I can hear the squealing. <laughs> I hope you can hear that. Well, I didn't catch everybody leaving earlier on to do go digging because I was busy doing the sorting the raffle prizes out and doing the sorting the tickets, etc. But we've got approximately 62, 63 people digging with us today, which is fantastic. The rain's just coming in, unfortunately, and it's very, very windy. We are having gusts up to 40 mile an hour today. But if I can zoom you in a little bit. This is actually Chagstock, where they hold the Chagstock Festival. So this field is the actual field that the festival's um, held in. And there's, we've got, I think it's five fields today. And everybody's out and about in there. And I think they're gonna get a little bit wet. As you can see, I am hiding in the cow shed. Ooh, that's a bit, there you are. I'm hiding in the cow shed next to the tea and coffee urn best way, place to be I think when it's cold and windy outside I didn't have hardly any sleep last night as you'll know by the video it was like being a part of the Blair Witch Project that's all I'm saying but yeah rings are coming up pan coins and coins all new stuff at the moment in this here field but I'll be back shortly cheers then Look at the weather guys, I don't know if you can see how bad it's raining, look it's dripping off there, look it is absolutely hammering down and the wind, oh my word, can't see how bad it is, look, look at that. What a nightmare. Is Tetris rushing back to get in the dry? Well, I've just caught up with Adam and Hello, Adam's doing a, a live dig. Oh, look, oh, look, look what she's done to me. It's a it. moo tube. It was a gold ring until you pointed that camera at it. I saw it change. It just went full. Don't listen to him. He's got about 20 quid in his pocket. Don't you listen to oh. him. And then he's got a moo tube. Might be done, doesn't it? Well, that's the first one of the day, though, eh? It is, yeah. The rest of it's been quite good. Oh, I didn't show this. I have a look. Isn't bling? Wow, a Isn't bling! That brilliant. Oh yes, and guess what? It's a wizard. Yeah. Adam dug this ring up, and now he's got me a bangle. Oh look. There we are. And it's on my ring finger. I did say yes. So Sam, I'm moving in. That's Adam's wife. I'm moving in. <laughs> oh, funny. There you go. I'm going to jump on that now. Look. What are you swinging today, Adam? You're not to? Me, not to mainly, yeah. You're not to mainly, okay. Look at that nice. It was a moo tube. It was a ring until 
But I've got a ring and I've got a bangle now. Yeah, I will. I'll be uh, all blinged up. The sun's coming out. It is very, very windy. We are having gusts up to 40 mile an hour, but the sun is out and it's it's not freezing cold anymore, which is the main thing. So, where are you off to now then, Ad? Wherever you want to go. Go get some more cash. And then we'll save the other fields for this afternoon, eh? Yeah, right. Okay. All right then, see you later, my yeah, lover. Cheers, then. cheers. No, cheers. Cheers, then. Cheers. 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 Well done. <laughs> A little Mr. Cordine, look what he's been finding then, guys. A lovely little silver ring. That's nice. What's this to then? James the first. It's a... Try get a... Not focusing. A James the first hammered... Why is that not focusing? There we are. I've got a new phone guys with a new camera so look at that. Saxon coin. Absolutely gorgeous. Beautiful. Well done. And we've got nice little locket. Little charm. That's a charm. Yeah. Them are charms. And another nice silver ring. Oh, Mr. Corden, it might fit me. I've got. No, James. Oh. I haven't asked you. Oh. Oh. Look. <laughs> it nearly fits. Oh. I haven't asked you. I'll say yes. Oh, sorry, Adam. I'm already betrothed to Adam. Oh, well done, Mr. Cordy. Yes, thank you. Yeah, go get a cup of tea. Yeah, go get a cup of tea, Mr. There's our Adam, there's our repeat. Are you doing there with his hat? No. A young lad up there, I will film in a minute. It's fantastic. We've got some young um, youngsters come out today, and young man up there, I will film in a bit. He has found himself a silver bangle, and he's, in his words, he's buzzing. But we'll have a little chat with him later. There he goes, look. Little duck. He's, oh, he's chuffed to mint balls he is right then guys i'll come back to you shortly cheers then oh no that's no i didn't say then yeah, cheers then no cheers then no cheers <laughs> just cheers you little tinker you <laughs> right everybody meet louis let's try and get you a bit of light on the subject we're looking a bit dark it's absolutely guys just so you can see how bad the weather is it's absolutely Persisting it down. So this is Louie. He is in the dark. Come round this way, sweetheart. Let's see if we can get you in the in the light. That's better. Turn up. There you are. There you are. And look, everybody, what Louie has found. Louie has found this beautiful silver bangle that has been handmade and hammered. You, Louie, are very, very lucky or experienced. Do you think it's experienced? I don't know. I think, I think it's experienced because you're trying very hard, aren't you? Yeah. And tell everybody what metal detector that you've got, Louis. I use a Garrett 250. Well done. And how long have you been metal detecting for? About two years now. Two years? Yeah. Oh, my word. You must have started when you were five. Is that right? Yeah. yeah. How old are you now, Louis? I'm 10. So. You're 10, so that means you started when you were about 8. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, pulling my leg, aren't you? And well done. I'd better hand this back over to Louie. Well done, Louie. It's wonderful to see you on our dig. Shall you come and dig with us again? Yep. Brilliant. You take very good care. Where do you live, Louie? Bickington. Bickington. Near well, right. So have you come? Is that a long way or is it just a short way? 
it's about half an hour drive. Oh, that's well, that's okay then. That's, that's not far at all then, Louis, is it? Well, you make sure that when you leave, that you get somebody to take you to Mackey D's for your tea as a special treat for finding that wonderful silver bangle. Okay. And I think it's very special. And I'm sure all the YouTubers are going to give some fantastic comments on your wonderful find. Thank you. You're welcome. And I'll see you again, Louis. Yep. Right, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pause, guys. I've been put to shame. Put to shame. Lady Jane has found a quid. A quid. And this young lad goes out with his garret and finds a blinking silver bangle. Amazing. Well done, Louis. Detectress of the future. And just as the rain stops, our Bob, our Bob from the, the fireman, he's used to getting wet, happened. and he's coming in. Look, Soaking wet. look at him. This is how much it's rained here today. Look, he's dripping. Twenty-one off, I bet. I have to get sweat. And yeah, <laughs> <laughs> digging all them holes. So stop now. At least the ground's a bit softer. Yeah, you go out again and it's not. How have you got on, Bob? Okay. Yeah, not too bad, mate. Found lots of coins. Brilliant. Some little bits of um, rubbish. Yeah, what's going on here? Who chose this music? Not me. Sure? Not me. Yeah, positive. This wasn't me. It's going to start snowing in a minute. No, I'm going to pause you now, guys, because we're taking the mickey Jolly again. Manifest, isn't it? So last night, then, guys, I slept in the car. Um, we put the tents away and everything yesterday and slept in the car and I've not had a good night at all again. It's just been awful, really bad way, wind and really bad rain. I mean, look at this. We've still got campers who have stayed, um, but I think for me now, it's time to give it up as a bad job. It's 5 a.m. in the morning now and yeah, I've not had hardly any sleep at all and um, not been feeling too well. Luckily the loos are just round that corner there, port loos. Um, yeah, so I've not been too well through the night, which is unfortunate because we're hoping that this rain goes by lunchtime and then um, it's supposed to be clearing up for the afternoon but I just don't think I'm gonna last that long at all not with the night I've had so this could be the end of the video we haven't been a I haven't been able to um, do much recording in any way due to the weather um, I think I managed to do 30 minutes yesterday all told in the whole day because one I was looking after the raffle and everything first in the morning and then we had the, the such bad and I mean like this is now but sidewards rain when the wind is just blowing it sideways so yeah it's been a tough weekend and then guess what happens tomorrow it gets better and Tuesday it gets better and then Wednesday we're back to 23 degrees again so minimum so that's the way it's been it's about right isn't it about right you plan anything put a lot of hard work into something like Pete has and then it gets ruined by one thing like weather okay guys so the possible if there's more video footage on the end of this, then fantastic. If not, there'll be all the pictures of the finds to look at. Cheers then. Bye.